Hi, I'm Rhiannon from Barbecue Spit Rotisseries, and I'm gonna show you how to cook incredible pork belly bites, all cooked on the Flaming Coals Cypress Spit Roaster. Now, pork belly bites wouldn't be complete without the perfect pork crackling on the outside. So the first thing we're going to do is, the day before we're going to cook, we're going to score the skin, we're gonna apply a liberal amount of salt, and we're gonna leave that in the fridge overnight. So we've left the pork belly in the fridge uncovered overnight and as you can see there's still quite a lot of salt sitting on the pork belly. So what we need to do is scrape that off with a knife. Now we've removed the excess salt from the top of the pork belly, I'm going to flip it over and give it a bit of a trim and a rub. And today we're using the Flaming Coals Greek Euros Rub. Now we've rubbed the pork belly, the next step is to slice it to be put on the skewer. and repeat the step for the whole pork belly. So once we've sliced the pork belly to thin strips, the next step is to put it on the skewer. Now these skewers are really sharp, so be careful. So now we've got this pork belly onto the skewers, it's time to head out and light the charcoal. Today we're cooking with Mali root charcoal, and I'm gonna show you how to get it started my favorite way, which is using the Flaming Coals Charcoal Starter Wand. So the Charcoal Starter Wand has two settings. The first setting is a low fan, but a high intense heat. That will give it the initial spark. Then when you have that spark, you'll flick it onto the second setting, which will back off the temperature, but really pump it full of hot air and spread that flame. Let's get this going. So as you can see, it takes just a few seconds to get that initial spark. Once you have that initial spark, it's time to flick the switch and pump it full of hot air. So our charcoal is now lit and is piping hot. It's time to put the pork onto the spit. So these are looking absolutely incredible. You can see that the crackling is forming on the outside, the juice is all coming out from the fat. Um, what I like to do is just double check that they're ready um, by checking the internal temperature with an instant read thermometer. You might need to turn the motor off temporarily, be really quick because we could end up with a fat fire. Now it's really important when you're testing the internal temperature of pork belly that you're piercing into the meat and not the fat because the fat will read a higher temperature than the meat. Now the internal temperature that I'm looking for the pork belly is 85 degrees Celsius. So these ones are ready to come off. Okay guys, so here we have it. Pork belly cooked in the Flaming Coal Cypress Spit Skewers. You can see here we've got some beautiful crackling. There's only one thing left to do, chop it up and enjoy.
Mm, so good.